Hello, I'm Cambrell Marshall, KPRC Channel 2 Meteorologist. We have the exact track radar set on the last six hours. One that started right now, 4 o'clock in the morning. Strong storms making their way through the Houston area, the leading edge of it with some big heavy rain about an inch or so within an hour's span of time, moving well off to the east of us. The residual line of showers coming through. And on the back side of that, we'll see clearing throughout the day today. Here's a look at what the a whole big picture looks like. This is the line that came through first thing for us in the morning. Here's the back side of that. So you can very clearly see that's the back side of the front itself going all the way up to the upper Midwest where they have not only rain to the south, but snow and freezing rain to the north. Big treacherous area of travel for you today if you're planning on heading in that direction. For us, looking down at Galveston, we're still on the cool side. 59 degrees of Bush Intercontinental, 54 in Sugarland, 60 in Galveston. Look at those winds. North, northwest winds at 17 miles per hour. Throughout the region, we can see the temperatures are going to be on the cool side, cooler than yesterday. 60 in Galveston, as we talked about in the 50s, lower 50s in the areas to the north. Look at the temperature differences between yesterday and today. 14, 15, 17, 18 degrees cooler right now than it was yesterday. So you get the picture and the winds from the north, so that makes it even more uncomfortable. Highs today, don't think we're getting out of the 60s. So upper 60s throughout much of the areas as we look at them. 67 in Conroe, 66 in Huntsville. I think these are optimistic temperatures, by the way. Down south, uh, Angleton, 69. Plasters may get to 70. We've got that cooler north wind coming in today, though, and that is what is going to help to work to keep us a little bit cooler. Hour by hour, the planner, as we go throughout the afternoon, we did have a, a 70 in there, but I just took that off. I just don't see it happening throughout the day. The winds will start to die down in the afternoon, late afternoon, but until then, 10 to 15 miles an hour winds sustained with gusting winds 20 to 25 miles an hour. Here's a look at your long term forecast. There's that 70 sneaking in there. That's really optimistic. I don't think it's going to happen. Think of upper 60s there instead. 72 for Friday. Good Friday looks good. Saturday and Sunday, very slight chance on Easter Sunday. Get out and enjoy that. And rain chances really come back in the forecast starting Wednesday of next week. Enjoy.